everybody, it's Nicole with Stargazer Soaps. I am making a new soap. Um, this is, the scent is Cool Citrus Basil. And I'm doing the heat transfer method, thermal soaping, I've heard it called so many different things, but um, I'm in a hurry, so I don't have time to master batch my oils right now. And I don't use a microwave, and was trying to save myself a step, step by you know, heating them on the stove, cooling everything down, soaking room temp. Just doing it this way. And I don't have a lot of time to be doing this. I just looked at my watch and realized I'm supposed to be driving out of my driveway in 10 minutes for a market, and I haven't even packed my car yet, or made lunch, dinner, whatever for that matter. Oh yeah, I didn't just realize I was going to put dinner in the crock pot. I haven't done that either. So I think I've bitten off more than I can chew today. Oh well. Still a couple of chunks left, but that will stick blender will take care of that here in just a second. That all blended. So, cool citrus basil. I was thinking I wanted to represent all the colors. So here is basil. I might add to that. And citrus, so lime. And oranges. Lemons, and I am going to add to these. And I'm making a mess. Oh well, I'm also kind of in a hurry. A little bit more. Okay, we'll call that good. Let's. Oh my gosh, I made beyond a mess here. is going to be white. And I'm going to go ahead and stick blend all of these. And fragrance. Somewhere here it is. I have no idea how this is going to perform. The supplier that I got this from, they don't really have reviews of how fragrances perform, or information for that matter, so I'm winging it. Sometimes I test before I use a fragrance, this one is not. But it smells really good. I have plans for a lot of new soaps, fragrances that I've never used before. Oh, this is nice. No rising. Blending up nicely. Okay. Stir all of these really fast. Will you have your sister get out everything for me that I need for my salad, please? She knows what it is. Thank you. It's still nice and good. Call that good. The 
some white. And then let's go basil. Remember the order I did this in. My brain's going in a thousand different directions right now, so. We're down that down the side a little bit there. gotten away with doing less color. It's okay. White's getting thick, of course. Still manageable. Last pass. I'll save the rest for the top. Thank you. I don't know if I had left enough color at the top, I could have done a cool swirl. I didn't think about it till now. That's okay. This smells amazing. It smells so fresh. It's very refreshing. for a while. I'm not sure why I haven't soaked with it yet. You know, I've been doing so many remakes lately. I just really haven't had time for the new fragrances. So. not make this muddle, which is a danger when you have a lot of color on the top. 
I know you can hear my daughter close by. She is not in my soap room. But we have a big open house. And I'm in a big open space. So she can see me. And she's right here. She doesn't want to be in her playroom right now. The kids have the room all to themselves just for their toys. So she's out here where she can be heard, and that's just the way it is. She knows she's not supposed to be out here. She doesn't always listen because she's kind of close to the beat of her own drum. She's three. But her sisters do a good job to try to help keep her out of the way. Out of this and left it. Hmm. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't swirl it. I always swirl. I don't know. It might feel unfinished if I don't swirl it. What do you think about that? Swirling is kind of my thing. What do you think? Splattered or should I swirl it? Yeah. I think so too, because the orange just kind of got overpowering there. Okay. So, I guess I shouldn't stack those in front of the camera. I'm just going to do a little light. Light swirl. And a little bit of glitter. Maybe, just want to come out. There you have the citrus basil. Don't go anywhere. I will have the cutting attached to the back half of this. This. Okay, cool citrus basil. We went ahead and split this. This still smells really good. You know, it's always a hit or miss with citrus scents, are they still going to smell? So we'll see how it does after cure, but so far, oh that's cool. So far, it smells really good and that's really pretty. Did you see that? Look. Ooh. Oh, look, okay. It's another piece. Backside's really cool. I wasn't sure how all these colors were going to work out, but I'm pretty happy with that. I'm loving my new mold now that I've got my measurements all figured out. Look at the back of that. Mm, pretty. I'm just, I'm having a lot of fun with it. And I just, I love, I mean, can you see? I hope the color is coming out. It's pretty, pretty vivid um, here, but the lighting might make that a little hard to see. I can't tell. It's so hard to tell on the little screen. But this is cool citrus basil, and it will be cured mid mid July and be available on my website. And I do have a new website, StargazerLuxuries.com. We're transitioning the name from Stargazer Soaps to Stargazer Luxuries, but we're still also going to be Stargazer Soaps. So you can find me at both places, StargazerSoaps.com and StargazerLuxuries.com. Stargazer Thanks for watching. Bye.